Hey, glad you made it back. Welcome to the Master Procreate series on my channel. Today I'm going to show you everything you need to know about Page Assist, here found in the wrench icon under Canvas. It's a very neat tool. You can use it for coloring books, journals, calendars, so many options. Let's get started and I'll show you how. If you were to, for example, buy a coloring book, digital coloring pages, something simple like this, once it opens and loads, I will show you. There we go. This one has six coloring pages. It says there's Procreate file format and a PDF file format. So the PDF you already know how to use, just print and color. The Procreate file format is and would be set up as this. You open this file and it comes in with pages this open. And no matter what page you tap on, it jumps over to that layer. Within Page Assist, it will show you a page or a group at a time. So this specific one, there's 25 groups. Within each group, there's two pages. And instead of going through all the layers, I can just sift through the pages down here and okay, this looks fun. I want to color this. I tap on it and it automatically asks me within that group, where do I want to color? On the line work or where it says color here. Tap color here. Grab. A nice bright red. I'm using dry ink from the inking and I can start coloring in. And this allows me to color without interfering with the line work. If I choose to erase anything, the line work is completely fine. Also with this example, if you open up the layers and you tap on the layer, the inking layer, so this is page 18, and I tap reference, go back to my color here layer, I can now color drop, continue filling, color drop and it will use the inking layer as my reference. You can change colors. You can even bring out your colors like so, so you don't have to do tab extra. And choose any colors you'd like as you go. When you're done, oops. When you're done, just tap your brush icon, close your color palette, and you'll be done. If you come back, maybe in a day, maybe in a week, maybe in a month, and you would like to recolor this, but you don't want to erase it, all you have to do is add a new layer within this group. Just turn off the old layer, just turn it off, and continue. Choose new colors, new patterns, and color away. So that's Page Assist using it as a coloring book. If you bought a digital coloring book like this, but they did not have a PDF file format that you could print, for example, you wanted to print, just go to your rich icon, share, and right here, share layers, PDF, export it to your files or another program, and then you'll be able to print it each page. And it'll show as one page per group. You wouldn't see these extras. So there you go. That is coloring book with page assist. If we now create a new layer, for example, I'm going to use screen size and I want to create a journal or a sketchbook within Procreate. Page assist is awesome for that too. French icon, toggle on page assist. And there's so many cool brushes now that you can download to create different patterns. For example, I have some fun planner grids and lines and dividers that I can use. Oops. Those are dividers. Where's my, I got lines. I have grids, polka dot grids. That I can use. Now this is all on one layer, but I want my details and my written on two different layers. So it automatically creates one layer, one page. So this is where you need to create a group and then it becomes one page. I can grab dark blue, just grab an inking and I can write anything I need. Create a new page. When you tap new page, it automatically creates a new layer. But if again, I want two layers because I would like to decorate and write on top, 
you will need to group that. And of course, rename your groups as you go. A very fun resource is everytuesday.com. Her resource library, you sign up for her email, she sends you the password. So many fun brushes. If we just start going through, we have washi tapes, we have skinny labels, fun detail labels, badges. She even has Hello Summer brushes, stamp brushes, so you don't even need to write. She just is done. Flowers. And there's rip paper. Scribble shapes as well. Those are pretty fun. And lines. And these are the dividers that I was using. So definitely check out everytuesday.com. You can download all of these and create a lot of fun things. If you're using this as a sketch, sketchbook, you can also create a divide. So let's hold on. Where's my planner divides? I'll use this one. I'm going to turn on drawing guide, edit my drawing guide. I'm just going to draw a line down the middle. Like so. I'll create a new layer, bring it below. Got to group this for a second so I can see it. And I'm just going to grab a gray. And grab the monoline brush. Bring that over so it's in the middle. And now Gaussian Blur. I'm going to use Gaussian Blur to fan out that gray. Move it over a bit so it's in the middle. Turn off my drawing guide. And now these two I'm going to connect into flatten into one layer. So I'm going to flatten. Tap here on page assist. Use as background. And no matter what page I'm on, I will see that dotted line with the gray. No matter how many new pages we create. So I can use this as my sketchbook. So let's jump over here. Uh, this is a new layer. This is a new group. Perfect. I want to use my grid paper that I just downloaded. Maybe dark blue. Beautiful. New layer. Grab my pencil from the sketching folder. Maybe I'll grab like that ready orange and I can sketch out strawberries. As my daily sketch for today. Whoops. Color drop. Grab a green. And today's date. And there you go. And with each new layer, it can be a new sketch. Or you could use this as a journal as well. Very cool, especially from every Tuesday brushes. And again, if you ever need to export it, share, you want to share layers so that each page comes out as a PNG or PDF. Happy creating. Let me know in the comments below what else you'd like to learn from Procreate. And I'll create, I'll continue with these uh, mini series to make sure you guys are ready for anything and to do anything in Procreate. Talk to you soon.